Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Paolo here. We are having a great time in uh, Sanford Formula One circuit. We are right in front of the North Sea. I'm gonna show you footage of what's look like around here. And you can probably hear on the back all the noise of the other riders uh, going around the track. It's absolutely crazy and mental, the new design with the new inclination, very, very steep, very exciting. Looks like and sounds and feels like a roller coaster. You will see on the footage on board. It's really, really cool. So guys, join me, have a look at this crazy lap. Let's go. So we are right here in the pit lane, waiting for our turn to kick start. And as you can see, the sky looks so gloomy quite menacing we have the wind blowing 40 kilometers plus Formula 1 truck completely resurfaced it has been redesigned uh, not major updates no major upgrades this truck has always been good fun uh, it really looks like a roller coaster with all its up and downs. It's a proper uh, dune truck, so all around the dunes and um, uh, so it, it's uh, it's not one of those modern uh, flat, completely designed truck on uh, on a computer. And you can probably see all around us. And so the scenery is stunning, uh, although the weather is not so great today and um, the three corners they have redesigned uh, they are actually uh, quite exciting uh, well feel how strong the wind is getting and um, so basically there is three corners uh, the the third corner and the last corner that uh, they have been completely redesigned with um, a very steep inclination uh, creating this kind of bunking effect uh, which uh, certainly helps the downforce of the Formula One and uh, other cars racing but it definitely does not help us on, on the bikes I have to admit that they are exciting it takes a bit a few laps to get adjusted to uh, but the last one it's um, um, yeah it's very very strange uh, you go into the corner and you 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 take it uh, let's say on the edge on the left hand side on the edge is right hand corner and uh, you feel that okay you are now going to the corner and you can start uh, cornering to the right but in reality you would be better off just doing nothing and let the corner guide you through because the moment that you start leaning towards the right then actually the bike goes way too fast in the inside to the inside of the corner and then you end up having to constantly adjust your line in order to uh, basically um, yeah keep up in the middle and then in the end you are either end up in the middle or uh, or on the on the right hand side of the corner because well definitely you don't want to be too much on the left side where uh, the wall then uh, you know starts approaching uh, so very exciting uh, experience uh, however uh, I must admit that for the Formula One it's certainly a highlight of the race and it's highlight probably even driving on a car maybe we're gonna take a car for a spin here just to experience that uh, inclination and uh, yeah that excitement but um, uh, when it comes to uh, motorbike riding I I don't think that uh, these kind of corners they uh, uh, they are very uh, bike friendly um, um, uh, of course in the end you, you do manage to find a way a kind of a common middle ground where to you know to take the the, the racing line but uh, you know if it was just a very fast not so steep corner with a very uh, wide um, you know uh, runoff area I think uh, everybody here would have appreciated much more on the other hand they have completely taken down the chicane uh, right uh, after the the third corner so the fourth corner used to be a chicane there now actually is a very fast left 
and um, you basically give it full throttle coming out of the third corner and then uh, you accelerate keep accelerating going uh, uphill and um, uh, it's quite an interesting view the one of the uphill because it's quite steep again so it really occupies all your field of view and then you basically keep on climbing going uh, going up and then you you steer towards the left and then you have a very fast right hand corner so that's a very fast s and that's very enjoyable they did a great great job there and uh, i believe that the lap time uh, comes down uh, from my what i used to do 228 to 218 thanks exactly to that s probably i've not improving much uh, on the other parts of the truck which apart from the being reef surfaced uh, you know they are pretty much as they used to be but uh, thanks to the chicane well to the cancellation of the chicane and now we can take those couple of corners so much faster it's so much enjoy more enjoyable the fast especially on a thousand cc machine so guys we are getting ready uh, so come on with me on board like subscribe and uh, let's get uh, excited in some for Formula One <laughs> Come <laughs> on.